What if I told you that you can create dynamic video motion graphics easily and with minimal effort to capture the attention of your audience and add excitement to your videos? Welcome to the power of green screen motion graphics on the Yolo Box Pro. So green screen technology has been around for a while. But what makes it so powerful here is that we are using it to overlay motion graphics instead of being a background on a video. It's all about your ability to create dynamic visual content for your clients. We are going to leverage the power of the green machine inside the yellow box. You can then seamlessly overlay stunning video motion graphic over your videos in real time, live, and on location. I will show you a couple of examples to get your creative juices flowing. So let's start with the first example in PowerPoint, as this is an easy way to green screen. And if you do corporate presentations, then getting your hands on the client's PowerPoint files will be easy. Now, I'm not going to walk you through animating in this series of videos, but you can find a bunch of great tutorials on the subject for both animating in PowerPoint and editing Mogerts, as well as a wealth of free templates you can leverage online to get professional results. Let's hop into PowerPoint for the first one so that I can show you how to switch the background and how to export it to video. Okay, so we're here in PowerPoint and uh, what we'll do uh, to get the green screen, usually if you uh, bring in your PowerPoint, you can just right click format and here with the solid color set up then you can just uh, select the color in this case we'll choose a green and we're good to go and then file export create a video from here we want a full hd uh, and uh, probably around five seconds and that's pretty much all we'll need to create the video and I already had saved one out here, uh, so we won't do that again. But basically, you would export at this point. That's it for that one. So uh, we'll go into Premiere for the next one, uh, now that we have exported the PowerPoint one. In Premiere Pro, basically, we're working with um, a Mogurt, the second sample that we'll green screen. So right here in uh, the overlays, I have already a motion graphic that I pulled uh, from my browse tab and brought onto a 1080 timeline. And what we'll do here is basically all we need is a matte green. So I'll just create a matte color matte, click OK, and then we'll set it to green. Pretty much any green will do. Once we get that down, we'll do green color matte, click OK. Oh, there's the green color matte. We'll drag it into here. We'll extend it for the full clip. And basically, as you can see here, we have our uh, green screen all set up. Okay, now that we've exported both, uh, we have to load them onto your Yolo Boxes SD card so that you can set it up and import both of these files we just created as local videos. First things first, in the Yolo Box, we need to go to the settings cog over on the bottom right and under local video se uh, switching settings. Enable continue playing when switching. This will allow you to see it and time it in the switching pane when you are live. It'll make things easier. Also in the settings panel in the local videos play mode section, enable loop. Now go to add video source in your video switching pane. Click on one of the local video buttons to add it to your queue. Select the thumbnail of the video you want to select and click done. First, click to the left near the time on the thumbnail to start the video looping. Then in the video switching pane, with it up, you should see the screen video you just inserted. Click top right of the circle with the play and gear icon and press to go into edit mode of the local video. From there, turn on keying switch, then adjust any of the settings like size, etc. to your like, then hit done. Preferably, you do all this at the beginning of your event before it goes live so that it's queued up and ready to go. Now, to get the video to overlay another, you need to use the picture-in-picture -picture functionality in the Yolo box. So go back to the video sources and select one of the picture-in-pictures. You have two of them. Then select the camera you want to overlay, say HDMI 1, then click done. Then select your motion graphic video, then next, remove the border, 
Don't touch the subscreen shape. Leave it at rectangle as it messes up the video overlay. And you are off to the races. Just use the picture in picture overlay anytime you want to use that motion graphic. You can also use the black background version of the local video graphic. Double click it on the video sources as you'll need to restart the motion. So what are some of the pros and cons? See the full list at the beginning of the video. For the pros, you can create eye-catching content that grabs your audience's attention, adds a professional touch, enhances the storytelling experience of your production. Now, the usual green screen cons come from the technicalities. Green screen requires proper lighting, equipment, and skilled operator to avoid any hiccups and to get it right. In this case, we can control the green screen colors so it is seamless, and with practice, you can launch them easily in Yolobox. So it's clear that the power of the Yolobox green screen technology combined with motion graphics can create some truly amazing visual content. The possibilities are endless. Tune into my motion potion video to see how you can get animated overlays in your overlays panel in the Yolobox.